Next question is, what inspired you about the breed? Yeah, inspired is a little bit big. As I mentioned, I always uh, liked the Bull and Terrier breeds. Before that, I liked uh, natural dogs, more the wolf-like dogs, uh, a lot. And I also like that they have that natural ambience and they uh, also have uh, nice uh, uh, features. But in practice, they are not that uh, beneficial. One, wolf-like dogs are not that nice in temperament. As you compare them, for example, with Bull and Terrier breeds, they bark, howl, dig up, they try to escape. <laughs> That's all types that terriers can also do. But if you have a boo and terrier, they are a lot more relaxed. Also, they are not howling. They don't bark as much. Boo and terrier type of dogs are uh, strong dogs. So silent, strong type. That I liked. The fur of a, of a polar dog is a lot, uh, yeah, a lot more um, time consuming so you have to take care of it it gets uh, dirty you have to uh, the the undercoat will blow all types of uh, things that i don't like third i like a lot with uh, this uh, short coated uh, dogs that they have a very good uh, ability to exchange heat also there's a benefit that you can see the musculature a lot better and then the most important part their character of a bull and terrier is a completely different than natural type of uh, dogs they are very brave they don't back down they um, they will go to fire for you to hell that is sometimes I say but i don't believe in that but they will they yeah, will really put it down and uh, that's very nice and also extremely friendly on ge in general uh, to uh, humans that's a good thing if you have children, for example. If you have an Akita yeah, with that uh, uh, character, it is for a lot more protective. Also, if children will interact, the Akita might pick a side and attack the other kid. Remember that. If you have, for example, a shepherd type of do dog, it can also be very dangerous for your children. If you're not there to uh, let the dog know that the child is above it, because the dog wants to go higher in the hierarchy. With Bull and Terrier breeds, this is uh, very often not the case, which I really like. Also, they have like an on button when they are outside and you, you keep them exercising and also an off button. They can be very relaxed as well, not always that hyper. 